I'm Dr. Barry Levine. I'm a board certified dermatologist and I wanted to announce tonight uh, that we have a new tool in our belt to help treat and fight acne. And I can tell you that um, I'm extremely excited about this technology and we're also excited to be one of the first in the country to offer this to our patients. Yeah, and acne is much more common in areas where we have uh, increased sebaceous glands like the face, uh, the neck, the chest. And the sebaceous glands are the oil secreting glands that make a product called sebum, which moves up our, our follicles and comes out on the skin. Oh, However, there are times when these pores can get clogged and they can um, uh, trap that sebum in there, which causes acne. In addition to that clogging, you also have bacteria on the skin that migrate down this follicle, and when they get involved and in, uh, intermixed with this sebum, create significant inflammation, and that's where you get the redness and the discomfort that comes. Uh, so what's different about the Acure laser, however, is that it targets the sebaceous gland. Things. One is they had, had to figure out how to uh, cool the skin and the, uh, the epidermis and the dermis so they wouldn't cause uh, damage to those areas. But also, they had to figure out the, what they call the peak epidermal temperature, is how, how to get that energy down to that level and, and create that denaturing of the uh, sebaceous The glands. laser comes on the, uh, on the epidermis. It has a special handpiece. And when it cools the epidermis to a certain temperature, the laser beam is emitted in pulses to target just the oil secreting glands. The epidermis, the outer layer of the skin, um, and the dermis are protected from this cooling mechanism so you're not creating um, problems such as scar tissue. And so you're putting all the energy where it need, needs to go. Pathology of skin, you can see the different layers here. But down in here, you're going to see the oil secreting glands or sebaceous glands. In this type of skin where they're enlarged, you're going to see a lot of sebum coming up. After treatment, you can see where they're denatured. And these have uh, shrunk down significantly, and you're not going to have that excess of sebum that is coming up that follicle and has a propensity to get plugged. So they've proven this uh, in their studies by histology, which is re really important. We can treat uh, any area that is involved with acne. So most commonly it's a face, but we can treat the neck. Uh, we can treat the shoulder areas, the chest or the back all the areas that are acne prone. Generally, it's done as uh, four treatments. And what they noticed that in the first, after the first treatment, uh, there was already a 40% improvement in the majority of their patients in their, uh, in their FDA uh, clinical trials. With each subsequent treatment, they got significant more improvement uh, to the fact that after the fourth treatment, um, most of these patients had over 80% improvement in their acne. That is equivalent to what we normally see with people that are on Accutane, which has previously been our, our gold standard, that it appears to be durable. So um, these patients' results seem to last. I think the data is out to almost three years now where these patients have uh, maintained results, which is very exciting. We have a few pictures here. These are from some of the clinical studies. And you can see um, the patients have had significant improvement of inflammatory acne. When we're doing a treatment, how, how does this work? But so. They come into the office, their face is, is cleansed. We then you have to use a topical anesthesia. Um, so we put a topical numbing medicine on, generally for approximately 30 to 45 minutes because we want to make that area uh, comfortable while they're treating. Once we have the uh, numbing medicine um, protocol completed, it's cleansed off, and then we do a grid pattern on the face. And that's to make sure that we have um, adequate treatment of all the areas that need to be treated. So it's all mapped out uh, with a grid. Protective eyewear is placed on uh, the patient as well as all the staff, and all safety protocols are, are utilized. We then start the treatment um, and we follow out this grid pattern to make sure that we're evenly treating 
all these areas. A treatment takes approximately, uh, depending on the area, approximately uh, 45 minutes. Um, when the treatment is, is done, the face is cleansed again. We use sunscreen and we give them instructions how to take care of it. The, we understand that it's a financial commitment uh, to have laser therapies and, and the approximate pricing on this depends on the area uh, that is being treated. Uh, for example, uh, a, a full face is approximately the $3,600 to $4,000 amount, which includes the four treatments. Um, so we worked with a financing company to uh, try and make it as accessible to our patients as possible. And we can get this down to uh, an amount that's affordable for, for most patients in that 100 to $150 a month. Right. We are very excited about this technology. Uh, we're excited about uh, helping people with acne uh, because um, we think it'll make a very big difference in the lives of our patients. Thank you.